To begin our math lesson today, we're going to do something that we haven't done before. We're going to solve a logic problem. Okay, so pull out your Saxon math booklet, boys and girls, and you'll see what I mean by logic. Um, it is worksheet 10A. It's right after this one that we did with the dots yesterday. Okay, so this is the word logical reasoning. It's called a problem solving worksheet 10A, and it's page 27 here. And you will need your crayons and your pencil on this one. So we have to listen to the story, okay, to solve this problem. Okay, so it says Latrice, and I want you to circle the L on Latrice, okay, capital L. Jessica, that's the second name here, so I want you to circle the J. We're going to do something with that. And Kyle, circle that capital K there in his name. So do you see where I circled those? One, two, and three. Latrice, Jessica, and Kyle come to school by car. Okay, so on this one, right under this car, I'm going to put an L. That's for Latrice. I'm going to write a J under this one. That's for Jessica. And I'm going to put a K under this one. That's for Kyle. So go ahead and do that. I'm going to wait and give you time. Put an L under this car, a J under this car, and a K under that car. Okay, so now this is Latrice's car, this is Jessica's car, and this is Kyle's car. Okay, so I'm going to, fin I'm going to read the rest of the story. Each rides to school in a different color car. The car colors are green, blue, and red. Okay, we can't color anything yet because we're going to try to figure out who drives what car. Latrice comes to school in a red car. Aha, so we know that's Latrice's car right there. So then you're going to find your red crayon. I'll find mine. And I'm going to color that car red. So go ahead and do this along with me. Just use your crayon and you're just going to color that whole car red. It doesn't have to be perfect. Okay, just to know that that's the red car. So we know Latrice comes in the red car. Okay, okay, there we go. Okay, so <clears throat> then it says, the car Jessica rides to school in is not blue. Okay, is not blue. So we had a choice of three colors, red, blue and green. So if we're looking at Jessica's car here and it is not blue, that means that the only other color left that it can be is the green car. So we're going to color Jessica's car green. Okay. So that's a clue by saying what it's not. It's not red, it's not blue, so the only other color left we have to, to color with is the green one. Okay. So that means that Kyle comes to school in the blue car. So you're going to find your blue crayon and go ahead and color Kyle's car. Okay. All right, now remember if I'm going a little bit too fast, go ahead and pause the video. Just pause it and then press play when you're ready to rejoin us because we're not quite done yet. It says circle the car that Jessica rides in. Okay, so we know that Jessica comes to school in the green car, so we're going to circle that right there. Okay, and then it says what at the bottom here, there's a picture of a crayon and they want you to color that crayon because that says what color car does Jessica ride to school in? And we know because we've circled it that she rides to school in the green car. So I love logic problems. I used to, when we used to go get camping when I was a kid, I used to bring books of logic problems with me. Um, I don't know why I like them so much, but they, they are fun to do. I hope you enjoyed that lesson. And um, I'm gonna put this away and we're gonna get ready for our next lesson, which is also gonna be awesome today, boys and girls.